All right. What's up, everybody? Toaster, Tapster. I missed the last half of last episode. We got 115 Atlas now, right? Uh, no, I think... <laughs> Uh, I wish. I think we are at, um, 70-something? Yeah, welcome, everybody. Uh, yeah. We're gonna make a lot of progress tonight, I hope. Uh, what am I at right now? What's my starting point? 70. Okay, we're, we're at exactly 70. That is our starting position. And I think I'm really getting close to having most of the lower tier, um two atlas points to allocate i think we're really getting close to having most of the lower tier maps done um not quite all of them but i think i'm getting close um let's see what is this divination cards from strong boxes and your maps are duplicated currency items from strong bo boxes and your maps are duplicated yeah let's do that uh but yeah we're gonna chill play some poe i'm hoping to make a lot of progress tonight get a lot of maps done yeah, it'd be a good night. My phone is being weird. It won't charge. Okay, whatever. Uh, let's see. What should I grab next? Are there any more? Let me see if there's any more map uh, map chance. Okay, wait. How would I put this? Uh, it's like 2% increased chance of maps dropping, I think is what it was. Evolve side area. No... I think I might have, wait, 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 what's this? Do I not have these? Oh, here we go, perfect. All right, let's go back to my base and get my bearings and see what our game plan is here. I know that, let's see here, which, okay, so I've done all of tier one. I have almost done all of tier two. We need arcade and wharf. We have one more left in tier three which is overgrown shrine we have one left in tier four cemetery we're done with tier five one left in tier six promenade we have let's see cursed crypt map in tier seven orchard in tier eight okay we're getting close to having all the lower tiers done one in tier nine and two in tier ten and then it's all red maps from there. Ooh, boy. Whoa, look at all these. Holy crap. Wow. That's a lot. All right. So this is... Okay. I actually have one tier 16. Wait, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Wait, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. What are these? I guess these are uniques. So they have two separate tiers for uniques, it looks like. Yeah, okay, I see. And then tier 16 and 17 are here. And and this is what, 17 and 16 are where you fight the Ubers, I think. If I understand that correctly. Uh, but it looks like I don't have any that I have not completed. It looks like everything I have, I have completed except for the higher tiers. One is unique maps, the other is for guardian maps. Guardian maps? these ones superior plateau map so the bear and the crusader one is is one of oh that's right okay and those are how you unlock the ubers is by doing the guardian maps right you have to defeat enough uh guardian bosses to get the to get access to ubers i think that's how that works let's see if kirok has anything nope just regular pinnacles oh okay Boss maps, okay. Does he have anything I have not completed? All right, we're doing a Kirok mission. That's a simple way to start the, start the stream. Ubers are from tier 17s, okay. Uh, let's see, any I have not done. All right, here we go, Tw uh, Promenade. That's one of the ones I need to get done. What about here? Okay, we're doing the Promenade. Where'd it go? Here we go. Twisted Grounds Promenade. Monsters have a 35% chance to avoid poison. Area inhabited by skeletons. 30% life. Uh, area of effect. Monsters poison on hit. Monsters blind on hit. 
That's fine. We're doing it. We're doing it. It looks like blind only lowers my accuracy by 20%, which might actually affect my damage. What's my accuracy right now? Uh, 3,700, so minus 20%. Yeah, that would definitely put me below my life. Kirok it up, bro. I'm ready. I'm ready. We're Kirokin' it up, getting his inventory refreshed, and hopefully we'll get some maps here. I'm getting really close to doing all my low-tier ones. Um, all right, yeah, we're in it. All my auras are active. Just don't get hit. Yeah, I think that's... <laughs> Sounds like a plan. I'll do that. I'll do that for sure. There probably will come a day where I can do the lower tier maps without getting hit. That's probably possible at some point. Maybe not right now, but at some point that might be possible. Okay. So blinding doesn't actually block out my screen. It just lowers my accuracy. That's interesting. 28% uh, increase... What the fuck? 28% increased... Uh, Number of rare monsters, players are cursed and feeble. Okay, okay, we can do this. They're a big titty goth girl from Garden back a bit. You missed her. Oh, I did? Okay, I'll go back. <laughs> Gotta go back for that. All right, so much for not getting hit. Oh, wait, no, the modifiers don't apply to this, this one. This one has its own mod. Oh my God. This one has its own modifiers. Jesus Christ. I'm just gonna rush to the end. Wait, I just did a big circle. Wait, what the fuck? Hold on. I gotta pull up the map. All right, I see where I missed it. I see where I missed it. Speed, I am speed. Oh God, nope, I gotta kill stuff. Lookout map. Uh, I don't believe that's one of the ones I'm missing. Wait, is this the boss? Yes, the boss. Oh my god. I was... I missed all my attacks. Oh my god. This just puts me right outside the portal, right? Yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Bad start. Okay, everybody, stream starts now. Uh, this is the start of the stream. Everything that just happened before that, please... Um, that was a mass hallucination. It didn't happen. It's one of those... Oh my god. Oh my god. Gilth Gil Gilthelm? Far shot, extra life. Heals allies and suppresses foe recovery. That's what it is. Oh shit. Alright, I gotta use my totems. Son of a bitch. I gotta use my totems. Also, I don't think I had my auras up. Oh boy. What a great start to the stream tonight, huh? I really am good at this game. Nobody can say I'm bad at this game. Look how good I am. <laughs> okay. Dead. Is this guy got the same thing? I don't know if he had the same thing or not. I don't think he did. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Put him. Put my totems. Something in here killed me really quickly, so let's be careful. All right, all right, all right, all right, leave. I gotta remember my health potions too. Ooh, okay, all right, we're good. We're good. Wait, what? why is he back? Wait, why is he back? He got rezzed. All right, wait, let's just get, let's just get it really quick. Sacrifice at noon, sacrifice at dawn. All right, we're out. Not really worth it, but whatever. Ball side areas are spooky. Yeah, that was weird. I've never seen, um, a single mob like that have rep uh, suppressed recovery. I think it's the first time I've seen that. Vol, vol side areas are tough in the beginning and not worth it later. Oh, they're not worth it later? When the deodorant says 24 hours, but you drink it in eight minutes. <laughs> That's funny. The faster you drink it, the be the more effect it has, but the shorter the effect. Hold alt in case uh, it's hiding a vol molten shell if you don't have it yet. Oh, you're right. I don't have that yet. Hold on. Let's go look. That's actually a really good point. That's a really good point. I don't have that yet. I can't do Wait, do I not? I don't have that yet, right? Yeah, I just have regular molten shell. 
Yeah. Okay. And those will only drop in here, right? In these, uh, in these uh, corrupted side areas. Okay. It doesn't look like it dropped. I don't see it. Vol, Vol Reap. I'll grab that. I do think I need Vol Molten Shell. Um, let me double check. Uh, skills. Uh, where would it be? I think it'd be on... Yep, I do need Vol Molten Shell. Just buy it. Can you buy it? Wait, you can buy Vol Gems? I didn't know you could buy it. You can corrupt them manually or just buy... Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, why don't I just do that? I didn't think about that. That makes so much more sense that you can corrupt it yourself. Top right harvest. Oh, right. Let me go back. Let me go back. Why is my leap so slow? Oh, there it is. I see it. Let's do it. I'll probably uh, thank myself later on for doing these side mechanics as much as I am. If I just skipped all these, I'd probably regret it later. I would imagine. I could be wrong, but I would imagine that's the case. Get it done now so I don't have to do as much farming later. Oh shit, okay. From the trade side, of course. You can make one Vol Orb on Molten Shell. Okay. She wants the juice. You can buy almost everything on the trade site. Trade site, it'll be so cheap. Okay, that's fair enough. You're learning the mechanics, that's also true. Yeah, for sure. It's it's educational extracurricular. Yeah, because that way I can... Um, the more I learn about these side mechanics, the more next league I'll know exactly what I want to like hone in on, hopefully. They'll probably introduce a new mechanic next league as well, right? They, they introduce a new one every league, I would imagine. I don't know why I did a portal. That was stupid. Vol Pyramid Map. Ooh. Is that another unique map? That's another unique map, isn't it? Wow, they're all blue. I'm not getting any yellows. They will every league, okay. And do they, they don't keep every mechanic though. They might get rid of some next league. Oh boy, that looks dangerous. I'm dying. Holy shit. I can't wait for you to do that map. Maybe I'll do it tonight. I should be powerful enough to do it tonight, I would think. I've already done one unique map. It's really dangerous, so it's good for you, for you to have low XP for when you rip in that map. Okay, so I'll wait till I... Well, I got low XP now. I got low XP now thanks to all those deaths I just had. I'll see what my experience is after doing this map, and then maybe we'll try it. I can't do, this just yet. do the unique maps count towards the 115, or are they are they separate? They count, don't they? Yes. Okay. Most of them do. Okay. That's good to know. Come here, skeletons. You ain't got shit. What tier is this map? 10, I think. I think this might be a tier 10 map. I don't, I don't actually remember what tier this was. Silo, I've definitely done that one. Definitely done that one. I should probably stop picking up these heist maps. I, I never do them. I don't know, they just don't interest me that much, to be honest. I really just want to get my Atlas done. All right, whatever, skip them. If they don't die in one hit, skip them. <laughs> oh, I can't move. They stunned me. The Atlas has 100 regular maps and 15 un unique maps, if I remember correctly. Okay. This is this the boss? No. Uh, right, here's the crafting recipe. Oh, wait. That might have been the boss. Wait, is that the boss? That is the boss. Residence map. I think I've done this one. 
Okay, map is done. Let's get out. Running on these side mechanics is good because you can figure out what you like and don't like. And then juice the ones you love, block the ones you hate. I don't think I hate any of them right now. I think my favorites are probably Blight and Delves. Actually, you know what? Probably my least favorite is Excavations. What's up, Blood? Welcome. Running them without the Atlas Tree juicing them is not worth it, really. Okay. I see. Are there any of these I have not done? Nope. Except for this one, the pyramid map. Well, I'm pretty low experience right now. I could I could do the pyramid map. Uh, 25 strength, max mana, regen. Okay, we're gonna get rid of that. We'll sell that. Let's uh, let's sell that really quick. No, not purchase. Sell. There we go. How many hours on Steam? Uh, let's actually see what what is what is my hours played? Played. Let's see. Uh, three days, three hours. So that is seventy. That is eighty-one hours. Right? No. Yeah, that's eighty-one hours. On Steam, like total hours. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I would imagine that's my total hours because I have. This is the only character I've played. Uh, put all this away. So I, I think that probably should line up with my total hours. Yeah, this is my first character. I didn't complete my first Vol Pyramid this league. I think I'm going to try it. Let's try it. It probably will go terribly wrong. Um, <laughs> this probably won't be a good idea, but but why not, right? That's the fun of it. Uh, chests have 3,400 increased item rarity. Holy shit. Area contains no monsters. Wait, what? Found items have 23% chance to drop corrupt. Wait, how does it have no monsters? Watch him drop a double corrupted headhunter. <laughs> you can see it on the Steam page like where you turn on the game. Yeah, I, I'll check it later. Uh, let's see. I guess I can check it now. Where is Steam? Uh, yeah, 81 hours, yeah. So it's exactly correct. New player client plus streamer client. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead. I need to drop these. I need to get rid of these. Um, I don't understand what it means by no monsters. This map is like... A giant vault area filled with strong boxes. Oh. I thought you could drop these. You can't drop these? I think this will come in handy at some point. Oh, you piece of shit. What? That's stupid. Vaults of Edziri. You can drop them inside, okay. Just not in hideout. Okay, got it. I don't really want to run them. I don't really like doing the heists. I guess I can run a couple maybe, but I'm really trying to focus on my atlas. Okay, so I see. So there's no, there's no monsters. It's just a ton of chests. Golden touch, achievement complete. Oh, I just got an achievement, nice. Let's do this. Thank God. I'm sad you read the map before running it. <laughs> I, I'm I'm uh I'm not confident enough yet to not read my maps. <laughs> Granted, that would have I would have been like, what the hell is happening? Oh, over horizons, that's really good. What's up, Motorola? I never got anything good from this map, but there's a chance. Are there really not gonna be any monsters? There should be. Oh shit. Oh Gary, that's why you were saying I think you can run it because <laughs> there's no monsters. Wait, is that it? Hold on. There's got to be some other better stuff here. Orb of Augmentation. Purity of Ice. I don't need that. Come on, give me more ornate chests. What the hell is this? Is that all? Oh, here we go. Blight Scarab. Ornate Mace. It's a fun to troll newbies about this map. Yeah, <laughs> I was preparing myself for a bad time. 
I got so much from Vol Temples this league. Oh shit, I need to get more of these. It's not worth it opening all these smaller chests, right? The catalyst. Oh, maybe it is worth it. I guess I might as well. Scroll wisdom. I'm holding down alt to bypass my loot filter, just in case it drops something interesting. Scroll of wisdom. Nothing. Oh, there are more rooms. Hold on, let me, let me pull up the map. Oh, you're right, I missed it. Oh shit, I totally missed it. I open the mall, I can usually get a map or two. Oh, I didn't know there was a second room. Need to open the big chest in the other room. Okay. Portal scroll. Well, this is kind of chill. Wait, I'm, I have a feeling when I open this, something's gonna happen. I'll sell that, okay. The cash. Vintage or crafted, glittering and shiny, dusty or glittering, huge or tiny, secured within a chest or unearthed from your mining, find jewelry everywhere, no need for div divining. You can get a mirror from a small chest. All right, I'll go through and open all of them. Usually don't bother with small ones. Every small chest you don't open has between seven to 21 mirrors inside. I think you're right. <laughs> with the newbie streamer luck, it'll happen. Yeah, I did get a divine during the campaign. So keep this in mind. <laughs> Every chest you don't open is a mirror guaranteed. Such a waste of luck. All right, what happens if I do this? Whoa, wow. Okay, nice. I don't know yet what these do, these fragments. All right, absolutely nothing out of that one. Storm rain, ranger bow. Okay. Oops, I did not mean to pick that up. That's fine. Devouring totem. Scroll of wisdom. Come on, give me something good. Oh, here we go. Almost missed this one. Ice bite, orb of transmutation. Uh, my best drop was an eternal orb during the campaign. Act two of normal difficulty, I think. I don't think I've ever gotten an eternal orb. You can uh, place four of those fragments in your map device and see what happens. With, I think you're joking, but I kind of want to try it now. <laughs> now that you said that, I kind of want to try it. <laughs> you do have all four of the different sacrifice at X fragments. Just throw them fragments in. Dawn, moon, dusk, midnight. Eternal orbs haven't existed for about a decade. Okay. I'm going to try it then. Cobalt jewel. I'll take that. No. Come on. Give me something good. No more scrolls. I have plenty of scrolls. This is the last room, right? I think this is the last room. Cobalt Jewel Canyon map. I've, I've done that one. Damn it. They're worth multiple new mirrors now. Oh, shit. Give it a shot. No spoiler. Okay, I'll give it a shot. I'm totally down for that. That sounds fun. Best way to learn is just to jump into it, right? <laughs> just to jump in head first. <laughs> and hope that there's water in the pool. Don't even look. Just jump in head first. Oh, come on. Give me something good. Something. Anything. Just a crumb, please. All I ask for is a crumb, m'lady. Okay, fuck. All right, that's it. What's up, Cornball? Map is completed, okay. Try it, please. Okay, I'll try it. I'll try it. I don't know if you have midnight. All right, let me, let me take a look. Let me, hey. Nope, not you. Wait, no, yeah, I do need to talk hey, to her. Let me sell everything really quick. Uh, what's this worth? Chaos. Let's see. Let me add all my things. Chaos. No, it looks like this is this is shit. Uh, re request failed. Query is too large. Yeah, this is, looks like it's shit. I'm gonna sell it. What about you? Callus mask. Dexterity, increased evasion, fire resistance. Let's see what this is worth. 
select these. This is probably too many. I'll select the top five. Whoa, wait a second. Hold on. This might be worth a little bit. This actually might be worth a little bit. Um, what tier are, what, let's see. Tier three, tier four, tier two. No, this is probably not worth anything. Yeah, we'll sell that, damn it. Hey, I got rich last stream, so I'm not gonna be upset. <laughs> uh, let's see, armor, evasion. Um, cold, stun, block, okay, sell that. I don't know why, I picked this one up on accident, sell that. Okay, did I get any jewelry? No, all right, sell. All right, put all this away. Let me identify these. Okay. All right, ch chuck all this in, and then let me look at my fragments. Sacrifice at noon. It's garbage. All slots except chest needs to have high life. Okay. Let me put these away. And then these will be in my fragments, right? Oh, I do have all four. Oh, I do have all four. So we take one of that. One of these. One of these. I have one shot at this. Because after this, I don't have any more sacrifice at midnight. One of those. It makes a face. Oh, it does kind of make a face, does it? Oh, yeah, it kind of does. I can barely tell, but it kind of looks like it does. You get hundreds of them during a league. Okay. All right. Do they have to be in the right order? Probably not. No. We'll just put them in the right order for fun. They do. This Vol thing was the first content patch in PoE. Oh, was it really? They need to be ordered. Remember the order. So we have dusk, midnight, noon, dawn. Dusk, midnight, noon, dawn. Same order as in the fragment tab. Let me just double check. It looks like I got it right. Dusk, midnight, noon, dawn. Okay. All right, let's do it. Oh shit. I would have never known to, whoa. I would have never known to try this. Dream Enrichment, achievement unlocked. This was the first pinnacle boss. Oh, it's a boss fight? Oh, fuck yeah. I think you can gamble fragments with harvest, but not sure if it would be worth it. Probably cheaper to buy more if you want another chance. Okay. All my auras are active. Okay, now I'm nervous. It's a boss fight? The apex of sacrifice. Okay, here we go. Is it a full-blown map? Yeah, it is a map, okay. What? Let's see, monster level is 70. Okay, that's not too bad, that should be fine. I don't know the modifier, seven, okay, the only modifier on right now is 7% increased quantity of items found. That doesn't seem bad. I don't know if you can get more. But that should, that, okay. That's literally zero debuffs. You grab the map. Okay. Ancient Construct. Getting to the real boss here takes so long. Wait, does it really take a long time? This content was hard as fuck a decade ago. It's probably gonna be hard as fuck for me right now. <laughs> My spirits oh God, attack, attack. Why am I not healing? Okay, we're good. All right, I'm gonna try and go quickly through it then if this does take a long time. I'm gonna put on my speed running boots. There are harder versions, but you unlock that by spamming this. Okay. Stairs, all right. Is this the boss? This is the boss, isn't it? Or a... Uh, am I supposed to do something? Oh wait, no, they're opening, they're opening, okay. My body is ready, oh my god. Vessel of the Vol. All right, dead. Oh, and the other one's dead too. 
Oh, no, no, he's not. Oh, he did a lot of damage. Dead. It's probably going to be medium difficulty for you. Okay. The boss of this map can drop a fragment for the Uber version. Oh, cool. Do these remind you of anything? They kind of remind me of uh, Breath of the Wild. When you go into the shrines in Breath of the Wild and you have to fight the constructs. <laughs> But that's what that's what came to mind at first. They're the Act Two boss on steroids. Oh, are they? I don't remember the Act Two boss. It's been so long since I played Act Two. How long has it been? I've been playing this game for like what two months now. <laughs> it has been so long since I did Act Two. I barely remember. Oh God! Lots of projectiles. Strand map, we've definitely done that one. Citrine um, amulet. And one when one dies, the other enrages. Okay, that's why he suddenly did so much more damage. That makes sense. Amethyst flask, don't need that. Beyond scarab, okay. Alright, so my atlas does not impact this map. Alright, so apparently my atlas has no impact on this map. Oh my god, booby lady. What is this? <laughs> There's naked people. What have I walked into? All right, that was easy. It's funny that you barely remember the campaign. I know. Well, think about it. I've been playing this game in like three hour increments. <laughs> so it's actually been like probably a month and a half since I did act two. And also, I have terrible memory. That's my defense, and I'm sticking to it. We older players create a lot of characters and have done the map, the campaign multiple times by now. Yeah, I'll probably have it more memorized the more I run through it, but it, I've only run through it once. On my next character I create, I'm going to try and get through the through the campaign as fast as I can. I think, how many hours did it take me to beat the campaign the first time around? Like 50? Like 50 hours, I think? That one boss was really deadly back in the day, the trio. I barely even noticed them. <laughs> I barely even noticed them this time. The good thing is if I do die, my experience is, already, is, is really low right now, so I won't lose too much. So that is a good, uh, a good thing right now. I'm trying not to play PoE until PoE 2 comes out. Welcome, Inertia. I am playing PoE 1 right now for the first time in preparation for PoE 2. Yeah, it kind of would stink getting into PoE and then PoE 2 comes out. Um, yeah, that would kind of stink. PoE 2 was supposed to release yesterday originally. Was it really? I didn't know that. The beta for PoE 2 was. Oh, interesting. The closed beta. Knowing PoE 1 will def help you when you go to, into PoE 2. Yeah, I want it because I definitely want to play PoE 2 and I and I wanted to play the... Oh boy, I wanted to play the first one first. Wait, it's the Vol Lady. It's the it's the four boob lady. Hello there. Long time no meet. I've heard so much about you. Unless, unless did I beat her during the campaign? I don't remember. But you're not my queen. That is... That is presumptuous, presumptuous of you to say. Okay. So she summons duplicates. All right, careful. Okay. Oh God, oh my God, I should have done a portal. Oh, uh, God damn it. I just got one shot. Yeah, I should have made a portal. Both games will be very different. Yeah, that's at Ziri. Being immune to reflect makes her much easier. Oh, she has reflect. Okay. I'm very happy I have no reflect. Immunity to reflect. That's, uh, yeah. All right, I'm going to make a portal this time. I'm not going to forget. Yeah, I would have been dead if I didn't have immunity to reflect there for sure. I would have been dead quicker, I should say. Uh, okay. I'm going to get just do this really quick. Run back to the entrance. Drop a portal, and we're good to go. She's not getting me again. I got her this time. Damn, this place is long. Holy shit, this place is long. Oh, 
Oh god, come on, just go. Just go, ignore them. They're meaningless. Wait, what was that? Crimson Jewel? Okay, I'll take that. Gotta wash the floor, okay. She naturally has like 2% Reflect too. I wouldn't have told you no spoilers if it weren't for the Reflect Immune. <laughs> yeah, if I didn't know about the Reflect Immune, that would have been really bad. <laughs> okay. All right, once I get back to her door, I'm dropping a portal. I gotta remember. Okay, here we go. She's not getting me again. All right, portal. All right, there we go. I got her this time. All right, so that, okay, that's what I have to watch out for, the circles on the ground, I see. That's one skill I definitely need to get better at is watching the ground more. Oh, no. Wait, wait. Oh, okay, those do blow up. Shit. I thought it was just the... Is she dead? Damn it. She was so close to being dead. Damn it. I didn't think I was in it. All right, here we go. She's dead. Slink boots. Those could be worth something, maybe. Is that the end? That's the end, isn't it? Yeah, map complete. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Have you done Ultimatum? It has the same theme. Yeah, I finished one Ultimatum. I do like Ultimatum. Ultimatum's fun. That was a normal at zero. Okay, so next time I do it, it'll be harder. So if I do that again, it gets harder every time you do it. Uh, let me see what these are worth. 57 to max life, increased movement speed, increased evasion. Oh, these are worth something. Oh shit, these are worth something. Normal at Ziri is a chance to drop an... Oh, and I need an Uber Fragment. Okay, so they're separate. Uh, let's see. How much should I sell these for? Um, max life is 57. Chance to suppress spell damage is 26. Are those high rolls? Oh, yeah, those are high rolls. Well, not the max life. I might sell these for, like, what? Like, 50 chaos, maybe? I'm guessing that if I had the full roll on max life, it'd be worth more. You'll need all four uber fragments. And is the only way you get them by killing her? Different fragments for uber at Ziri. Is the, is the only way to get an uber fragment by killing her? Let me go ahead and sell this. Exact price, we'll do 50. Oh wait, I don't have my, oh no, there it is. Nope, nope, just 50. There are other ways, but that's the way to target the farm them. Okay. All right, well, that's done. That doesn't count as a map, does it? So if I play PoE 1 and buy the stash tabs, etc., will I get them in PoE 2? That is a very good question. Do you? Unironically, it's much easier to get Uber at Ziri fragments from other content, such as Ritual Breach. Okay. All MTX carries over. Oh, fuck yeah. Wow, that's that's uh, that's really cool of them actually. I wouldn't have expected that. So far, GGG has impressed me a lot more than Blizzard. <laughs> Any MTX you buy in either game will transfer to the other game if applicable. That's why I push you to get tabs too because it's also an investment for a P PoE too. Oh fuck yeah. That's awesome. All right, sell that. That is very, very ethical on their part. I like that. 1% uh, chance to block while wielding a staff. Um, cast speed, curse. Okay, we don't. I'll just store it for now. And I still think I don't have any maps I have not completed. Pretty sure I have completed everything I currently have. All right, Kirok. We gotta check your inventory. Please have the things I need, or I'll have to buy them. 
They said there will be things exclusive to each game that can't transfer, though. That would make sense. That would probably make sense. GGG has made a lot of mistakes, but they don't strike me as an evil cartoon company like a lot of other games. Yeah, they don't seem greedy in my mind. Um, they Nothing has struck me as greedy. There's a druid class in PoE 2, so it'll have shape-shifting, which means if you buy a werewolf or werebear, MTX and PoE 2 won't carry it. That makes sense. Yeah. Their mistakes have just been design and balance stuff for the most part. Yeah, not they've not they haven't done anything like the WoW token. <laughs> Alright, Kirok, what you got for me, man? Give me something good. Alright, here we go. Arcade map, take that. Uh Orchard map, take that. Ooh, okay, good. Yes, take that. Yes. Trow map, okay. Wait, that's another trial map. Terrace map. Okay, take that. Now, how many of these... Alright. This is going to be really helpful. I didn't duplicate any, did I? Let me make sure I didn't buy double of anything. No, I didn't. Okay, we're good. Got my eye on you. I don't think they can ever 100% ple please everyone. No, you never will, but you, but you know a way to 100% displease everybody? Pay to win. <laughs> That's a, that's a pretty surefire way to displease everybody. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay. So, and they already have... Alright, let's see. Nox, let's, let's, let's modify this one. Orb of Alchemy. Players are cursed with vulnerability. Monsters take 34% reduced damage from critical strikes. All right, that's fine. Wait, what did that say in the last one? Players have 40% less... Rec oh, that's bad. Players are cursed with elemental weakness. Monsters poison on head, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's fine. I just want them to rework bleed slash glad. Is bleed bad? Careful about some of those red maps. They cost chaos to buy and may not be worth it. Oh, fuck, I didn't pay attention. I target farm red maps I'm missing by using Orb of Horizons on ones of the same tier I've already done. That's not a bad idea. I can also always buy them from the trade site too. Alright, let me look at all these. 18 movement speed, lightning, monsters blind on hit. Okay, that's fine. Chaos, we need to actually upgrade this one. Uh, monsters have a 50% chance to avoid elemental ailments. Area contains two unique bosses. That's fine. That's totally fine. Uh, okay, that's fine. 25% more monster magic. Monster magic monsters. <laughs> uh, my fast reading skills are not good. Okay, that's fine. Yep, that's fine. Wait. Yep, that's fine. Area monster variety. Additional charges. All right, yep. All these are good. I can run all these. Bleed is not very good. Every other dot is in a better place, pretty much. It doesn't help that most bleed stuff is also melee, and Gladiator specializes in bleed. Oh, good thing I didn't play Gladiator, then. Bleed is fine, but is in a bad state right now. The best way to play Glad is to play as a Slayer and steal the bleed pop from Glad with Forbidden Jewels. Oh, okay. Thank you for the follow, Chiosmic. Thank you. Bleed Pain Champ. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and start with the lowest tier. I'll start with this tier two. And I think, uh, this is going to get me pretty close to having all my lower tiers done. I think I might only have like two or three left after this. What's up, Justica? Uh, 5% chance to drop an additional orb of alteration. Nice life. Suppress spell damage. Okay. Looks good. Too many Quinn cooked his ZPS, ZDPS bleed build streams. Is it Quinn's fault? Was he too good? <laughs> How's PoE for you? It's great. I'm having a ton of fun. I love this game. And I am very, very excited for PoE 2. Which I think the alpha... It's not the beta that comes out this fall, right? It's the alpha. And do I need to register for it? He'd like to think that. <laughs> yeah. I bet he would like to think that. Uh, but he probably is better at this game than I ever will be. Orb of Vault. Okay. Grab that. 
Let me get the strong box really quick. I saw explodes on there. What does that say? Explodes. Okay, the box itself explodes. Lots of orbs of all. Okay. Let me grab all these. I actually need these. No, I don't. No, these are not what I need. I need the one that turns them into rares. It's closed beta late this year. Do you have to register? Because I'll need to do that. Layer map. I don't know how they'll do invites yet, but apparently they'll guarantee invite anyone who spent at least 500 US on the game so far. Oh, fuck. I don't want to do that. I don't want to spend 500 bucks just to be able to play it early. <laughs> All right, I take back what I said about them being ethical. That's bullshit. <laughs> Damn it. Sure you do. <laughs> oh my God. If that's really what it takes to get into PoE2 early, I probably won't be doing that. I don't know if they'll do open beta afterwards. They'll probably include it in MTX Pack 2. Okay. It's not announced like that. It's just some speculation based on how they did it in the past. I see. I see. I wonder if they'll put it behind a paywall, though. I doubt they would. Maybe they would. Maybe they'd have to. Yeah, maybe they'd have to. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know a lot about the uh, financial strategies of game companies. I would hope they didn't, because I want to play it, <laughs> and I don't want to spend five hundred bucks. Now, I, if I if they wanted me to, if I had to pre-purchase the game, I would do that. Then again, it is free to play. I'm assuming it'll be free to play, just like PoE One. Yeah, I'm assuming they'll keep it free to play. What is this? Why can't I hit them? Are these mine? Oh, these are mine, aren't they? These skeletons. They will sell a key for $100. I might be able to do that. That's still pretty expensive. 100 bucks? They do random lottery invites for free to play. Hmm, I wonder if they base it on the amount of hours played. Because that would be bad, because I'm not going to have as many hours played as a lot of people. Packed I've spent that much since 2013, so I'll get an invite for free. With energy. Well, yeah, since 2013, yeah. If I had played this game for 10 years, I probably would have spent that much, too. Personally, I've spent thousands on PoE 1, so I'll get a key, yeah. I guess that's the problem with jumping in when I did. I don't have the hours or investment to qualify like that. This is a tier two map. I should just be running to the end. All right, where the fuck is this exit? Wait, did I maybe miss the boss? Oh, please tell me I didn't just miss the boss or something. Okay, that, that way is all a dead end. But none of this is confirmed. They'll announce details later, okay. If they do any um, like announcement streams, I, I should watch that on stream. That would be good. There's still a chance they might give keys to new people, but not sure. All right, I must have missed the boss. It must be somewhere on the map. Oh, map's complete. Oh, I completed the map. Been playing since closed beta. Well, then you should definitely be invited. Bad PR from chat for GGG, yeah. <laughs> Wait, Alpha will be 100% just big streamers and shit. I hope not. If that's the case, I need to somehow miraculously become a big streamer. <laughs> just so I can play PoE 2. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Okay, we got a ring. Let's check that out. Fire, lightning, increased cold damage. Alright, we're going to sell that. I've very... I've, like... It's been a while since I've... Off like naturally found any kind of upgrade i don't know if i really ever will again i'll probably have to like either craft it or buy it um because it seems like the chances of actually just authentically finding an upgrade well why did i put all my maps away god damn it you can register your, your email on pw2 site they may send beta, beta keys through that okay i'll do that after stream for sure then alpha alpha will be like what one month Everybody will be able to play a bit later. 
It'd be really cool to play Alpha on on uh, while it's happening, but if not, it's fine. I'll just continue playing PoE one. Uh, cells map. Okay, we have not done cells. Let's see which one of these is better. Um, okay, accuracy. Uh, players have twenty percent less recovery rate. That's fine. We're gonna do this one. I don't like the reduced accuracy. I think that gets rid of my uh, DPS buff. Picking up good items off the ground is incredibly rare. Most people just turn off all rares on the loot filter pretty quickly. Interesting. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of noticing the same thing, honestly. At this point, you probably won't find upgrades on the floor. You should make your filter one step stricter. I kind of agree with that. Most everything I'm finding is, is worthless. Let's go to five. Uber soft core. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That way I have less to look at, less spam. Uh, wait, what? Corrupting Tempest? One craft remaining? What is this? What does this do? Corrupting Tempest? Looks like I can have this and this selected, or no? Uh, should I select Corrupting Tempest, or... Can be applied to maps, one craft remaining, areas affected by Corrupting Tempest. Should I save this, then? For a higher tier map? I'm trying to think if I remember what Corrupting Tempest is. Does that just mean there's a guaranteed portal? It doesn't really matter. Special craft you got from a node on the Atlas Tree. Oh, okay. I guess I'll just not do it. Uh, let's see. Suppress spell damage. Okay. Increase movement speed. Okay. We're good. It makes all your items corrupted. Oh, I see. So every item that drops will be corrupted. All right. I'm going to power through this one. We're going to go fast. Still going to grab the soul fight. For the buff. Pretty sure it's full. Oh wow, there's the end. <laughs> I already found the end. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, leech, rank one. Dead. That was easy. That was probably my second fastest map. It's not that good. You can use it. Okay. I should just grab all the maps I'm going to do uh, so I don't have to keep coming back here. Uh, let's see here. Which were the ones I was going to do? Um, here, here we go. Orchard map. Let's see. And then I had a tier 10 as well. Okay, we'll do these two next. Start with a tier 8. Uh, okay. Increase spoon speed. Acceleration. Okay, that's fine. We're making progress tonight. We're moving. I have 74. I've already done four tonight. Holy shit. It's been an hour and I've done four maps. That's pretty good for me, actually. I did not have my banner on that whole time. That whole time I was not using my banner. My spirit is spent. Nothing? Porcupine. The only problem I don't like is that it blocks out cards, too. I remember this map. I remember this from the campaign. This was part of the lunar slash solar area, right? Or like that part of the quest, I think. Nuggies and ramen noodles. I saw a, uh, a picture on the internet. Somebody was complaining that a restaurant sold them hot wings and it was just dino nuggies with hot sauce on them. And I was like, not gonna lie, that sounds really good. <laughs> dino nuggies with hot sauce? That sounds really good to me. I wonder if I can make a loot filter sound for when it drops cards so I know to look. Oh god. Okay, we're good. Absolute W. 
You can add custom rule to show cards or anything else you like in the filter. That's why you should always edit your filter. Uh, how do I do that again? Is that on that site? There was that one site that I, I went to, Forbidden Tome. Huh. I don't know what that is. Yeah, you can edit the sound. Okay. By the way, the biggest flaw in the filter, in my opinion, is that it hides scouring and orbs of regret. That is a big flaw. All right. I should definitely modify it then. I don't remember how to do that. I know there's a site to do it, I think. Oh, God. Traps. Oh, it's this lady. Okay. That was easy. Never mind. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Uh, carnal boots, orb of chance. All right. All right, that's good. Filterblade.xyz. Okay, let's do that really quick. Filterblade.xyz. Okay, uh, create new filter. My filters. Uh, config. Wait, uh, okay, this is my loot filter from, this is the one I built, but I think this one's really strict. Um, let's see, my presets. Forbidden Tome is for Sanctum. Customize. No, my filters. Load, config, delete, share. Never sync, uh, soft core, semi strict, normal. Configure, public description. Uh, let's see. I made Chick fil A sriracha sweet nuggies with spices that Wendy's uses in regular ramen noodles. That sounds amazing. Can create a new or load that one. Well, how do I modify it? I don't, uh, I don't want to create a new one. Load it. Oh, load. Okay, here we go. Okay, loaded successfully. Customize. I loaded it. Config. Now, am I customizing? Why am I so bad at figuring out these sites? My presets. Copy any item you don't want to see. Simulate, paste, hide. Filter blade is not easy to learn. Yeah, this is confusing me. All right, here we go. Never sync soft core. Okay, that's fine. Semi strict. That's fine. Uh, okay, here we go. Uh, style the, the loot fil the looks of the filter normal that's fine um, switch overview mode put it on very strict okay very strict compare strictness styles presets all right so these are presets so now I go down here filter overview so it's not going to show me I definitely wanted to show me these. Um, okay, wait, hold on. Copy any item you don't want to see, simulate, paste, hide. But I want to see this one. It's worth it. I would do uber strict. Anything below shows too much garbage. Okay. But I want to show all of these. Hold on. Jump to rule. Oh no. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh no. <laughs> God damn it. Filter blade XYZ. Load. Uh, customize. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Oh, it's still loading. Copy from the game. Control C. that
It's not easy to learn, but it's worth it. Copy from the game. I mean, copy the item. Wait, like from my inventory? From my stash? So, like, if I wanted to show, for instance, Elwerbs of Alchemy, I do Control C. That doesn't make any sense. I might have to figure this out off stream or watch a video on how to do it, because this is probably not going to go very well. Uh, and I'm embarrassed you guys seeing how slow I am. <laughs> All right, general vendor recipes. Um, go to simulate. Where is simulate? We all been there. Yeah, this is rough. This is this is kind of confusing. I might do this. All, I might watch a video after stream and do this honestly, because I think this is going to take me a bit to figure out. Um, yeah, let me do that. Let me just watch a let let me just watch a video after stream and figure it out. Next to customize. Oh, simulate. Okay. Uh, journey, valuable loot, okay, gear, currency, items, to, item types to generate. Oh, hold on a second. Uh, give me just a second. Get that shit out of here. Yeah, I shot him. Don't worry. He's done. He's done. <laughs> All right, we're going to do this after stream. I'm, I'm getting self-conscious about how stupid it's making me feel. Hail, God Slayer. <laughs> it's making me feel stupid. Uh, let's see if this is worth anything. That is simulating uh, what it would look like with the filter on. Okay. I'll watch a, uh, I'll watch a video after stream and see if I can figure it out because I'm feeling kind of dumb. All right, do that. Uh, okay, drop all these in. Have I done this one? Incomplete. Okay, no, that's the next one I'm doing. That's right. So what is this? Mundus Noster Sicidit. I don't know Latin. <laughs> I don't know what this is. I guess I'll just put it right here. I'm guessing this is a map modifier. Take this item to the relic altar in the Forbidden Sanctum to enter. Oh. That's a Sanctum Tome. A ticket for roguelike mode. Try it? Okay. I'll try it. Is this a lab? Wait, where's the... Okay, here, Forbidden Sanctum. Oh, I haven't done this at all. Okay, let's put this in. Uh... Boosting sensor, relic of bounty. Uh, okay, confirm. I tried it before and I left. Interact to select a room. For this mode, don't get hit at all. Oh God. <laughs> uh, offers items on completion. Okay. Contains fountain. Oh, this is cool. This is like a. Uh, oh, okay. I get this. Um, let's do. If you get hit, you lose resolve. Lose all resolve equals end run ends. Oh, you're serious. Oh shit. Okay. It's the get good mechanic. Okay, let's do this one. I guess. Leave Sanctum, Relic Effects. Pretty hard for melee. It's very cool, but a bit biased against melee. Okay, we'll see how it goes then. Okay, here's my resolve. I have 300 resolve. All right, I got it. Now, how do I, how do I activate it? 
Hold on, there's something I'm not doing. Oh, oh, okay. There we go. I had to press that button. All right, so do not get hit. All right, bad start. <laughs> We're off to a bad start. All right, all right. Oh, no. We are off to a very bad start. I'm already at 257 <laughs> resolve. God damn it. All right, we got something out of that. Oh, God, I'm dead. There's no way. Every room has an objective. Uh, defeat all the guards and rare monsters. All right, he didn't hit me. Oh, my God. All right. All right, we're done. We're done. So now I just leave. I can't do this just yet. Or is there an exit? There's an exit. Okay, I see it. Ah, learning slowly. This uh, this mechanic is for ranged builds that can hit around corners pretty much. Decides to do sanctum with melee, so you've chosen death. Yes. <laughs> These guys' attacks are very slow. You can sidestep them. See, there you are very much overestimating my skill. <laughs> you expect too much. I am not equipped. I do not have the skill. All right, let's see. Uh, items on completion. So I can only go here. Wait. Oh, okay, I went to a fountain. I'm guessing a fountain restores my resolve. These guys, uh, you collect coins to buy boons slash items for the merchant. Okay. Alright, areas have the same layout for all players. Okay. Alright, let me grab that. Oris. Alright, so I haven't gotten hit yet. Alright, so far so good. I haven't gotten hit. Not on this map, at least. However, if you make an Ice Spear Totem build next league, you should definitely do Sanctums. Massive rewards possible. Great way to make monies. I was thinking about doing like a, a either a ranged or a casting build next. Oh, I'm getting hit. Oh, no. I'm half dead. I'm almost half dead. That's great. All right, so now here's where the fountain is. Recover 25% of max resolve. All right, perfect. I'm going to have to really focus on getting these fountains then. Totems and mines are great. Okay. Yes, that is what I'm going to have to do. Um, abandoned library contains minor treasure reward. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do this one. Uh, okay, just this area has the same layout for all players. Oh, no. Oh, they do attack really slow. Get out of that. Okay, I got to watch out for these floor mines. All right, we're good. We're good. Open it. Thank you. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Oh, God. We got big boy over here. Oh, no. Oh, I'm doing really badly now. I'm aggroing everything all at once. My spirits are spent. Ooh, okay, that wasn't too bad. Templar cash. Nice. Ice Spirit Totem is technically a ranged caster build. That sounds kind of cool. Oh, no. Shit. All right, we're good. I don't know. I don't think I'm supposed to kill everything in here on this one. I think maybe I just find the exit. I can't do this just yet. All right, come on. Oh, no. All right, yeah, we just find the exit. Wait, let me grab this. Oh, no. 
He used double team. All right, let's leave. So far, so good. Templar cash, Templar cash. So I use these Oruses to buy stuff. Look at the quest. It just says, it just says, uh, oh wait, here we go. Oh, I see, I was looking at the modifiers, damn it. My build destroyed Sanctum during that league with the cold dot spell slinger. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make it very far if I'm being honest with myself. Uh, oh, I want the Orb of Horizon. Yeah, I want the or Enemies hit ignores your resolve mitigation. Okay. That's nice. Uh, why is the door not opening? Hold on. Wait, what? One shot all the guards and the boss. Yes, you really want to get the boon that reveals all the rooms. Wait, what just happened? Did I just, did I just brick myself? Oh wait, no, here we go. Bad choice. Oh jeez. Oh God. Okay, keep moving, keep moving. I haven't been hit yet. All right, I just got hit. Is he dead? Okay, he's dead. Summon raging spirits. Necro you could spawn homing minions that would that would go kill things like two screens away. Got nerfed in the league though. Hex blast mines is also insane for sanctum. Wait, what's this? Remembrance. When I was young, I never questioned our faith. Oh, I gotta go say goodnight. I'll be right back. ...of former Templars in massive ossuaries that fill the spaces under the earth. Each one is hallowed, we are told. Each one is sacred. Yet as I stood there on that broken day, gazing at the bones I was supposed to join, I realized that I had no idea who any of these people were. Lip service. Meaningless. So many have been forgotten, but I will be remembered.
All right, I'm back. Okay. Let's do it. I still have 200 resolve. So I'm one third dead. What is this? Can you be tempted? Yeah. Uh, we should definitely take the orbs of horizon. What's GY stand for? Still made some of the craziest items ever in the game. Got close to a hitless run once. Holy shit. Contains a cursed pact. All right. Graveyard. Oh, graveyard, right. Okay. My spirit is spent. Okay. I got hit there. Damn it. Find the exit. Okay, let's just find the exit. Let's not fight anything. It's probably dumb to fight things. Let's just find the exit. Damn it. No, I didn't get hit. I'm good. Exit. Exit. Where are you? Come on. Here we go. Ooh, okay. I wish I could grab some cool items. I still might league. Uh, got extended, but almost nobody on the market for... Market playing for me to make muns. Yeah. Sanctum rough for melee characters. Yeah. I'm going to make some of the end of the league for standard. Okay, let's see here. Uh, change your fate. You must accept a pact in order to be able to interact with this. Gain silver tongue. 50% reduce merchant uh, prices. Gain two random minor boons. Gain a random major boon. Lose 50% max resolve. Oh my god, no, we can't do that. Spent a couple of days uh, getting all the corpses and figuring out the orders to make those quad fractured stuff. If you don't like them, you can always close it. Uh, I don't, yeah, I'm not doing any of those. I need to find a consistent play group one of these days since my friends love the game. I've been solo. Yeah, I like playing solo for the most part. Let's see. See. Offers item on completion. All right, let's do this one. Maybe I'll get a good pack this time. Come on, gamble. I should have gambled it up. I just don't think with my current build I can afford to lose any resolve. Okay, find the exit. All right, we're just going to find the exit. Open it quick, quick, quick. Fuck, I got hit there. This is where my movement skills come in huge uh, handy. All right, fuck, I went to a dead end. Oh, get out, okay. It's gonna be this way. Yep, it's this way, perfect. I got the fuck out of there. PoE one is for solo, in my opinion. PoE two will be for party play. All right, let's see. Gain Vicious Iker. Monsters have 20% reduced action speed. Lose 25 max resolve. Gain 50% of current resolve as Auras coins. Lose 50% of current uh, resolve. Gain a random major boon. All right, let's do it. Another human tempted by power. What's my boon? The next affliction you gain is converted into a random minor boon. Okay. Okay. Contains afflicted fountain. Afflicts you with honed claws on entry. Offers items on completion. Contains minor treasure reward. Afflicts you with rapid quicksand on entry. Get it? Which one? Oh, maybe my chest delayed. Which which one of these? Uh, I'm thinking either this one, the tr the minor treasure reward, or the afflicted fountain. Templar anal's. I don't want to go into Templar's anus. What the fuck? 
I just like playing solo and selling things to craft my own stuff. Yeah, I'm kind of enjoying the solo play too. Let's do this one. I'm doing this one. It doesn't matter. I'm going to die anyway. Untuned loot. Okay. Uh, defeat all the guards and rare monsters. Oh, great. That's not a monster. I can't do this just yet. Oh god, get out of there. Oh wait, it says optional. Alright, he's dead. So am I done? Nope, we got one more. Okay. Is that everybody? Nope, one more. Looks like they're going to keep spawning for a bit. Okay, that one's dead. Oh, Jesus, there's two now. Okay. Room complete. Nice. Next room. I think I'm doing pretty good. I, I kind of don't like the idea of getting less items in PvE 2. I like the game in its current iteration, and I don't entirely trust GGG in there will be less but better items. I didn't know they said that. I didn't know they actually said that. Sanctum was such a fun league. Also, pretty sure you missed two rewards. Oh, did I? Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> of course I did. I like getting massive amounts of loot, but having a good filter in the game like Last Epoch. Honestly, could do without identifying so we can filter better. Yeah, identifying is kind of a, an annoying mechanic. You are not always taken to the room you select. Oh, wait. Oh, did I go to a different room? Contains Varicath the Waxen. So this is a boss fight. So if I beat this, I'm done. I've got 150 resolve. All right, let's see how this goes. Oh, I do not like that. Got, oh, it's candles on its back. The waxen, I get it. Oh, he's like Diablo. My underling will deal with you. Okay, so far so good. He's dead. I got this. My spirit is spent. I got this. Yep, he's dead. That 20% coal comes in handy. Now, there's nothing I'm missing in this room, right? So that's it. Can you be tempted? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to take the cartographer's chisels. And I'm going to take the... Uh, I guess the vol orbs... No, we'll take we'll take the ones right now. Their hypocrisy knows no bounds. All right, well we did it, I guess. All I must do. Oh, nice, we did it. A woman spoke to you through just like I'll outlive the adventurers. Nice, fuck yeah. All right, well we did that. Good clear for melee build. I made it through somehow. <laughs> I got to say totems help a lot. Oh, I did the first floor. Oh, so you keep going, I see. There are four more, okay. I see, all right, well that's fine. That's good enough for now. I don't feel the need to do any more of that. There are four floors, oh, okay. That's good, that's good for now. I'm gonna keep doing maps then. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Uh, ignite, okay, we're good. The final boss is that narrator lady with the orgasmic voice. Ah, I see. The lady who told me that her minion would deal with me. My minion will deal with you. Uh, so this is a tier 10, I believe. It's nice not having to worry, not having to worry about getting hit. <laughs> it feels really nice just being able to run now. Orb of Unmaking. 
Okay. Gem Cutter's Prism. See, like, Orb of Transmutation. I want those. I just gotta remember to check so every so often. Um, just make sure my loot filter didn't block anything good. The Loom Chamber. Orb of Scouring, I want that. Okay, good. My So my loot filter is showing Orbs of Scouring. That's at least good. Because I need those. Wait, is this the boss fight? This must be the boss fight. Yeah, this is the boss fight. I just fucking mashed that thing. <laughs> I face tanked it. Sanctum mommy. Slowed caught in a web. Alright, we're done. We're done. That is how many maps so far tonight? Six. I'm making good progress. Uh, we might actually complete my atlas sooner than I thought. Uh, let's see if this is worth anything. Nope. Nope. Not worth shit. Oh, I do have six unspent Atlas points. Thank you. Uh, okay, 2% chance from, okay. I wanna make sure I'm not missing any more of these connected maps. There we go. There we go. Now I think I still have some over here, don't I? Yeah, I do. All right. Now, do I even have any maps still that aren't red that I haven't done? I think all the ones I haven't done now are red. Uh, might as well do them. Might as well do them, I guess. I was going to try and focus on the lower tiers, but this is fine. Um, all right, no, this is fine. I can do this one. Stabbed it like Sam stabbed Shellob. Hell yeah. <laughs> Is it Shell? No, it's Shelob. Shelob. Not Shelob. <laughs> Shelob. Shelob. At some point, he will switch to a farm strat, right? Yeah, I think once I complete my um, full Atlas tree, I will. Don't forget influence on the red maps. Oh, that's right. Uh, wait, I need to corrupt this one, don't I? Okay, players have 60% less recovery rate of life, but that does not affect me. That does not affect me. Vol or no balls. <laughs> it's tier 13 now. Oh shit, okay. It's mineral pools. Have I... S okay, good. This is still one I haven't done. Uh, and then... Okay. No, we don't need to do any of this. We just we just run it. We just run it. And we are gonna do. What do my quests say? Okay, Maven's on tier 12 plus. Eater of Worlds is on tier 13. Okay, we're gonna do Eater of Worlds. Yeah, I'm gonna do Eater of Worlds. Can do Eater on this. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, strong monster in pack. Okay, 500% increased life for each monster in pack. Overwhelm 50% physical. Okay, that's fine. I think we should be fine. This is your first time doing full in-game? Yes. Evan Lucas, yes, welcome. This is my first time playing PoE. All right, let's do it. Yeah, this is my first time ever playing PoE. This is my first character. Well, technically I have a level two uh, gladiator. But I uh, didn't play him. I switched. <laughs> He's only level two. So this is, I guess, technically this would be my second character. But I only played the gladiator for about 10 minutes before I switched. Chaos Orb, nice. I'm rich. I am rolling in the dough now. I do have a couple divs I could sell if I need to. dead end. I like this map. This is a cool map. Let me know if I can help with anything. Okay, cool. Thanks. I appreciate that. Yeah, I'd, uh... There's a lot of learning involved. <laughs> I will say, sometimes after my PoE streams, my brain does actually hurt a little bit. <laughs> sometimes. 
especially when I'm learning a lot of new stuff. Orb of Fusing. Okay, let me see if anything else drops. Scroll of Wisdom. Yeah, I don't like that the cards don't show up with my loot filter. I want to get those cards. You hate this map? I think it's better to farm and complete Atlas. That way you can upgrade and not hit the lack of gear wall. Eh, you're probably right. I have to look into, if I was gonna do farming though, I'd have to, oh no. I'd have to really look into like how to do my second Atlas uh, tree. I love learning this kind of stuff, I soak it up. Yeah, I do too, I mean obviously I love it uh, cause I love streaming these games. But it can sometimes leave my brain a little bit, uh, <laughs> a little bit in pain. My spirit is spent. All right, where have I not gone? Down here. Wait, what the fuck? The map is not complete. What did I miss? I see it. I see the one place I didn't go. I can't do this just yet. Wait, what? All right, what am I missing? There must be some route I didn't see. I've got two divs now. You need any gear? No, I'm a, uh, oh, there we go, I see it. Uh, not at the moment. <clears throat> uh, once I hit a wall and I, and I can't progress, I will probably do some uh, farming indoor shopping. Oh, thank you for the follow, Oog Tug. Um, yeah. Yeah, well, I'm not gonna worry about gear too much right now because I seem to be doing okay. But once I hit that wall, I'll have to think about what I need to get next. Because the problem is I could spend the whole stream just on the trade site, you know, looking for upgraded gear. But I figure it might be best to dedicate one uh, like a stream to that specifically. Like there'll probably be a stream I do at some point where it's like, all right, we're getting better gear this stream. Get the corpses, come on, grab it. Oh God, get out, get out. Uh, I am level, yes, 88. how big I am. What are you playing? I'm playing a uh, Bone Shatter Slayer. Yes, a Bone Shatter Slayer. Oh, thank you for the follow, Evan Lucas. Thank you. Oh, we got one of these. Okay, let's see. Bone Zone can check gear and gems using stream tool, yeah. Can help crafting anything in the future? I'll, yeah, I'm, I'm not except, I don't wanna do donations, but I will trade for fair market value. Um, Eldritch minions gain 100% chance to create shocked ground on death. 2.2% uh, chance to drop an additional divination card. Uh, final boss drops three additional divination cards. Gains 59% of max life as extra max energy shield. Let's do that one. That seems fine. That seems fine to me. Ooh, yes, let's do this. Wait, 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 let's read it. Magic monsters, movement speed, 50, uh, increase attack speed, slaying enemies close together can attract monsters from beyond the realm. Chaos resistance, okay, that's fine. Eiffel Tower Strike? What is Eiffel Tower Strike? <laughs> also, why did my mind immediately go to the uh, not safe for work <laughs> version of Eiffel Tower? <laughs> oh, what is wrong with me? <laughs> my mind immediately went to that. Okay. Uh, I spent too much of my childhood on Urban Dictionary. 
trying to find funny words with my friends. I can't do this just yet. Are we done? Yeah, okay, we're done. Now he should have dropped I thought it said he was gonna drop divination cards. Oh no, that's on the other one. Okay. That's right, that's on the main map. It's called Trebuchet. Did you ever Eiffel Tower somebody? No. <laughs> and if I had, I probably would not tell my stream chat about it. <laughs> All right. Oh boy, what is this? What is this? Oh, it's killing me. Who is this? This isn't Marvel, is it? No. Oh god. I gotta keep his energy shield down. There we go. So this guy should have dropped some divination cards for me. Uh, let's see. Alt. Yeah. Th Reign of Chaos. Alright. Necropolis map. Firestorm. Alright, we're good. That's code for yes, I have. My wife doesn't know about it. <laughs> Our imagine, imaginations now wander, Royce. God damn it, I should have even brought it up. I shouldn't have even mentioned anything. All right, let's see. Uh, ooh, I have not, oh, it's a tier 14, okay. All right, so these are complete. Let's put these away. Uh, okay. Okay, so I might do this tier 14 then. Acropolis map that's a one of out of five of a mirror wait is that really no it's not no it's not okay no you're joking <laughs> okay you're joking okay he's playing the rusty trombone later tonight he calls it the bone sound <laughs> it's an ancient poe meme is it really it's funny i need to learn all these old poe memes because I sound like an idiot whenever you guys bring them up and I take you seriously. Uh, okay, let's see here. <laughs> I take a half of, I take, I have to learn to take things, some of, some of the things you guys say with a grain of salt. I can't just blindly trust everything. There was an actual trade of one mirror for five Necropolis maps. Was that an accident or was that intentional? Was that person just an idiot? Best trade in history. It was real. Oh my That's god. How did the guy knew what he was doing? Was he just like donating money? Uh, let's see. Uh, incomplete tier three. I already have one of those in my inventory. Oh, he's selling me a card. I think it was during a Pee race and his group needed high tier maps. Oh shit, so the guy was leveraging his, oh, I see. He could make the price whatever he wanted pretty much then. That sneaky bastard. I think we're gonna do an Atlas mission. This was an ancient PoE uh, where sustaining high tier maps was the difficulty. I do like the money laundering conspiracy though, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No atlas or anything of the sort. Oh, shit. So it was probably much harder to get maps back then. Um, let's see here. Anything I have not done. We might have to re-roll. I could do this unique promenade map. I actually have that one. Uh, estuary map. I can't do that one. This one. Sustaining the highest tier map was all but impossible. Not even kidding. Oh shit. It's impossible. Okay. Back when exalted orbs were the $100 bills of PUE, you'd legit exalt maps. Oh, I see. Old PUE, you had to be careful to sustain tier 14 to tier 16 maps. Oh, interesting. Damn, I'm glad I don't have to worry about that. Never do the Grandmasters, it's a pain. Will I need to do it? I'll need to do it to complete my atlas eventually, though, right? 
That map has player-made characters in it. Oh, that's interesting. This was before map had tiers. They were just referred to as level X map. Oh, Grandmasters isn't in the Atlas. Okay. Okay, good. That map, okay, good. I'm not going to do it then. I guess I'll do Estuary. You're not the first exile we Wait, but I think I have an Estuary in my stash. Oh, I thought I did. Never mind. Okay, we'll do Estuary. Day. You're not the first exile we've worked with. Half the characters in there are trolls. <laughs> okay. I want to try it someday, maybe. It sounds kind of fun. People spent $1,000 on the biggest supporter pack in 2014 or some shit. Oh, and they got to design characters. Oh, that's kind of cool. I do like I do like that there's stuff in this game that are that's fan made. Oh god. Do this just yet. I just almost died. Holy shit, I just almost died. My auras are active, yeah. Uh oh wow, I got a lot of stuff. Hold on. Give me something good. Give me something good. Not just an orb of scouring. Come on. Damn it. All right, let's do this corrupted portal. Are you solo self found? No, I'm not. But I only trade for fair market value. And I don't accept donations. But I'm not solo self found, not on this character. Wait, hold on. The reward was to create a copy of a character of your choosing from your account. Oh, and GGG would turn into a mob. That's interesting. The entire map is wave of five player characters. Oh, that's really cool. So they'd save the special MTX, make a character specifically designed to be impossible to kill, and make GGG put it in the map. Holy shit. It even uses character names and levels. That's so funny. That's cool, though. Those people have their characters immortalized in PoE. That's really cool. Even if it is kind of a joke map. Or refusing. Take that. Those are actually potentially valuable. Uh, if I ever need to make like a six link or something. Oh, no. Oh, I might die. At least burning ground no longer affects me. Now, let me get to the end of this. I forgot this is just a corrupted portal. Let's just get to the end. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot of enemies. Oh my god, I'm dying. Fuck. Oh, damn it. God damn it. Oh, I'm right here. Okay. Auras. Damn it. I just lost experience, though. Why does my leap not... Sometimes it feels like it's not really... Uh, I'm not traveling that far with it. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Don't die again. Do not die again. Piece of shit, do not kill me. My spirit is spent. Oh, okay, thank God. Alright, we're done. I'm looking for Vol. I'm looking for Vol Molten Shell. I didn't get it. Honestly, my fave Pantheon. Object occlusion, small rocks, etc. Wait, the one that prevents you from getting uh, hurt by. Uh, uh, burning ground. Wait, what is this? Tor Olgoso? What is... Mission complete. What was that? Was that... What was that mission? I don't... Orb of Alteration. Yeah, I've been using that. I'll probably continue to use it for the, for the foreseeable future. I don't know who that was that I killed. It said mission complete. It's probably some mechanic I'm forgetting. Shit. 
chest. All right. I don't need, why am I clicking chest? What am I doing? Sometimes my brain turns off. <laughs> why the hell am I getting chests? This is a tier 13, so I should actually be getting the, no, this is a Kirok mission. Okay, um, uh, I don't know. I think I might skip this. I think it might get me killed. You have a one-fourth chance to get a Vol Molten Shell using Vol Orb on your regular Molten Shell. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I'm just going to do that then. Yeah, I'm just going to skip that for now. I've had enough of dying for the time being. Oh my god. Wait, I'm going to watch this. I'm going to drop my uh, banner. And he's dead. Wait, what the fuck? Did a new guy come? I saw the death thing. Okay. Alright, that's it. Alright, that was a confusing mechanic. I don't really know what just happened, but... Uh, Alright, we're out. We're done. Let's get out. Let's see. Okay, let's sell this. I don't know why I picked this up. I did not mean to pick that up. Uh, and then wasn't I going to actually do... Wait, did I not get the thing for the Exarch? Hold on. Oh, no, I did. Pursue the Eater of Worlds influence in a tier 14 plus map, but I didn't get the item. Did I miss the item? Because I did the Eater of Worlds on that tier 13 map. But apparently I didn't get the item. Hey. It was a Kirok mission? I could have sworn the one before the Kirok mission I did Eater of Worlds on it, though. Eventually you will want to try to push some gems to level 21. It's good to level extra gems in the weapon swap you don't use. Oh, okay. Why? Why? What's the what's the reasoning? Um, incomplete tier thirteen. I have that one. Trow. Terrace map. Complete, 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 incomplete strand. Oh, this is a unique. It's worth eight chaos. Okay, we're not buying that one. Fuck. The only two I got that I can really do are the trow and the terrace. But I think I already have trow in my inv my stash. I may even have Terrace. More levels, more DPS. Okay. I do have Trow, and I do. I already have Trow and Terrace. I guess let's do Estuary, and we'll do um, Eater of Worlds on it. Let me give you maps. Uh, let me let me run through what I have, um, and then inst I would like to buy them. I know they're probably worth nothing. I know it's stupid. I'm poor, okay. <laughs> I can toss you some chaos for them. Um, let's do this, one, two. What? Oh, damn it, I hit the wrong thing. Okay, 20. And now we do Orb of Alchemy. Uh, burning Ground and Feeble. Okay, that's fine. Vol. Uh, number of rare monsters, temporal chains, elemental weakness. Oh shit, monsters blind on hit. Oh god. Oh Jesus, players have 25% less accuracy. This is gonna be bad. Divine Vessel at two for your Pantheon. Oh, is this one I need for my Pantheon? Uh, okay, let me grab one. Fuck, this is gonna be bad. I think I'm gonna lose my 40% buff to my, uh, damage. Yeah, 
Yeah, my POB is... I have my POB open right here. Um, but if you want to look up my build on Max Roll, it's, uh, it's uh, the Bone Shatter Slayer. I'm just doing the Max Roll build guide. Okay, let's see. Let me think. Let me think. Um... Eater of Worlds. Ooh. What am I trying to get out of this? What's the boss on this one? Uh, let's see. Sumter. Okay, it's Sumter. It's Sumter. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Wait, improved labyrinth trial. Area contains a labyrinth trial that rewards an improved offering of the god to the goddess. No, fuck that. Fuck labyrinths. I hate them. Four percent chance to drop an additional cartographer's chisel. Okay. Uh. Okay. Was there more imbued options? Improved offering is good. Is it? Okay. I just hate doing labs. <laughs> I hate doing them. You should have depth checked for imbued options. Okay. I'll use it. I'll use it on the next one then. All right, all my auras are active. All right, we're good. Yeah, this is, I think my DPS is not going to be as good in this one. We'll see how it goes. Hopefully it goes fine. Uh, w because I put in that divine vessel, the boss is going to be harder, right? Mineral pools map. I don't know if I've done that one. All right, let's see what this is. Hold on. Let me see what this is. Turquoise amulet. Now, do I have to select one of these for it to count towards Eater of Worlds? More life, more damage, basically. I hate Lab 2, but those can be worth a decent amount. Okay. Uh, do you have to do one of these in order for it to activate Eater of Worlds? No. Okay. Uh, Orb of Alteration. No. Basic currency items dropped by slain enemies have 16% chance to be duplicated. Okay, we're not doing any of those. Those suck. Uh, let's see. Scarabs dropped by slain enemies. No. 2.5 chance to drop an additional breach scarab. Prevent plus 29% of suppressed spell damage. I don't think I should do this. I'm not really sure what a breach scarab is. I know uh, you guys have mentioned doing breaches before. Only take them if you can survive the debuff and it's increasing item quantity. Yeah. I don't think I can survive these. Pick Breach. It's just a Scarab that forces Breaches. Okay. That's fine then. Yeah. If anything lowers my resistances, I'll be screwed. Oh, no. I can't do this just yet. Careful. That's a big angry spider. That is a big ass angry spider. Okay, we're good. All right. Oh god. All flame ember. Take that. Chaos orb. Yes. Thank you. I'm rich. We're getting so much money. All right. Wait. I forgot that I didn't get the shrine. Get that. Jesus Christ. There's so many enemies. Barrows map. Barrows. I mean. Okay. Jesus Christ, this is crazy. There's so much. I'm dead. Orb of scouring, map pool, okay. Orb of fusing. Get the, oh my god, that was actually insane. This boy needs some phasing. Just a good map. Keep attacking and don't stay at range and you'll live. Yeah, that's the key to my build is I have to keep doing damage. Otherwise, I'm not healing at all. 
Which is kind of hard when like a bunch of scary shit's going on. Going on, you, your instinct is to kind of run. Okay. The fortunate. I'm getting a lot of cards. All right, I gotta keep moving. I'm moving so slow. Dead end. I don't need to kill any everything. Keep moving. Let's get this done because this seems like an actually relatively dangerous map. All right, I just did a big circle. That's great. <laughs> I just did a big circle. Oh, that's a decent card. Oh, fuck yeah. Run slash dash and circle, then back into them, and you have to keep to keep leech going. Yeah. Yeah. I'm still uh. Oh, another chaos orb. I'm still getting better at the whole movement aspect of this game. All right, let's see. Okay, come on. I just want to read it. Will you guys leave me alone, please? Stop spawning. 10% uh, increased quality of items. Let's see. 73 additional physical damage reduction. Nearby enemies gain 100% of the physical damage as extra lightning damage. So you can run, but going counterclockwise, most projectiles will miss. Counterclockwise, oh, interesting. Counterclockwise, okay. I didn't know that. Um, 10% increased quantity of items found, 22% increased rarity of items found. I think I'm gonna skip that. The 100, because it gives 100% increased damage as lightning, and I think that could end up fucking me on this boss. Okay, counterclockwise apparently. Oh, I just did this boss. Did I just redo the same map? My spirits are spent. Oh god. Move. Oh shit, this boss is tough. All right, you know what I need to do? I need to drop my banner. Damn it, totems. I can't do this just yet. Oh my god. He hits he doesn't hit too hard, but he's got so much health. And I'm slowed. Alright, oh no. Yeah, we just did this boss. That's fine. Oh I'm dying. I'm dying. Where is he? Okay, he's almost dead. Yeah, I think if I had done 100% more lightning damage, I would not have lived. Ooh, okay, cartographer's chisel. Cartographer's chisel. Superior temple map, take that. Kite him out of the hole. Yeah, once he got out of the hole, it got a little bit easier to deal with. The maps are becoming a blur. Still saying XL, I know. I think they kind of are becoming a blur. I level up my gem. Yes, we, I know. Every time I say I'm slowed, I'm like, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just saying my name. <laughs> I'm slowed. Hello, everybody. I'm slowed. I got to start practicing my dad jokes. Oh, speaking of which, I'll probably say this again at the end of stream and tomorrow as well. But I probably will not be streaming next week. Um, we have scheduled the uh, delivery for next week. Um, so yeah, the baby's gonna be here next week. So I probably won't be streaming next week. Uh, I got some family coming in town. Um, so yeah, I'll be streaming tonight and tomorrow and then hopefully not next week, but the following Monday. What day next week? It will be uh, Wednesday, Wednesday next week. But I have a bunch of family coming in town. Um, so I don't know if I'll be able to stream at all next week. Yeah, the 12th. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm terrified. <laughs> I've been having kind of like mini panic attacks. <laughs> we found it. We, we, we scheduled it yesterday after going to see the doctor. So <clears throat> Sam Day is my birthday. Wait, is it really? 
Good choice. That's actually crazy. That's crazy. All right, we got to change it. I'm going to go talk to my wife. We got to change it. <laughs> you turned 37 on Wednesday. Well, hell yeah. Er happy early birthday, man. Uh, okay, we've done this one. We've done this one. But yeah, I just want to let you guys know. I'll be taking a week off. What is this? Eiffel Tower Strike. Oogtug. Oh, it's Oogtug. Uh, put this div card away. Let's see here. Radiant Jewel. A trade request. What are, you, what are you trying to trade me? Uh, I'm not accepting donations. I can't take these unless I pay you fair market value. But I appreciate it, man. I'll pay fair market value if it's something I need or if it's something I want. Uh, Chaos Orb. Okay, let's see. Put all this away. Oh, we got Turquoise Amulet. Ooh, it's a, it's a, it's a unique. Okay. Increase attack speed, cast speed, movement speed. Oh wow. That actually doesn't sound bad. I'd lose the physical damage to attacks and the accuracy, so I can't use it. But let's see if it's worth anything. No, it's not worth anything. It's not worth anything. Okay. God Slayer. Good day. Uh, sell, sell this. Yep. Okay. All right. So this is a tier fourteen. I need a tier fifteen for Eater of Worlds, tier twelve for Exarch's Influence, and tier twelve for Maven. Kirok. I think I bought everything from Kirok, right? Oh, no. He's got some stuff I haven't done. Yeah, here we go. Strand. I have not done... Oh, that's a unique. Damn it. And it's worth... He's selling it for 8 Chaos. I just realized, is your name a reference to Slodes and Elder Scrolls? Yes, it is. Yes. It's a combination of a reference to Futurama and Slodes and Elder Scrolls. So in Futurama, there's a character called Hypnotoad. Uh, it's just a toad that hypnotizes people and then slowed, so it's hypno slowed. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, yeah, I just, I don't know, I just came up with it. My hat out is sick. Oh, thanks. Uh, Gary sent it to me. It's a uh, Bioshock, uh, it's a Bioshock themed hideout. Yeah, Gary sent that to me. I have a trough map and I have a terrace map. Okay, so I, I've done everything he has. The job never ends. And I don't think I have anything I haven't done. I've done all tier one, tier two. I'm still missing wharf, uh, shrine map. I just grabbed it from Pewee hideout site. Uh, let's see. Just so you didn't have all the NPCs stacked on the waypoint, yeah. Uh, let's see. Okay, we've done. Okay, so we've done all of uh, tier six. We've done all of tier five. I need cemetery map in tier four. All right, we have quite a. We have two. We have one crypt map. Okay. We've done all of tier eight. We've done. We need glacier. And we need wasteland. Yeah, I just imported this. I didn't I didn't actually customize it. Though I did accidentally put up a random wall somewhere. <laughs> oh yeah, this wall right here. I fucked that up. Okay, wait. Um I can't access my stash. What the fuck? Can I not access it cuz you're standing there? Hey. Um I think I need to do an Atlas mission. Uh, let's see. There is a Thross mod in development for Skyrim. It's the home of the Slodes. Oh, that'd be awesome. The Slodes are always one of those uh, races that I wish we got more interaction with in Elder Scrolls games. I think they're really cool. The lore of them is really cool. They're fucked up, but it's cool. We go over there wearing the Royal Eldritch Helm. Looking good. He does look pretty good. Oh, damn, you do look cool. 
Alright, let's see here. Alright, so, oh fuck, I have to, okay, I have to re-roll his missions, I can do that. What is it that re-rolls his missions again? It's like the scout's orders or something? Yeah, these. He lurking though, yeah. What is this thing? Oh, interesting. <laughs> they really fucked up and mysterious. But that's also the appeal. Yeah, I like them. Explorer report, yeah. So I think I go here, right? And then I activate it. Okay. And Oog, I'm gonna dis I'm gonna leave the party just because I wanna do this solo. Um Oba's Cursed Trove Map. Okay. I've done all of these. Are you fucking kidding me? I mean, I guess I could do this one. There's no way I was going into that map. Your mind is not ready. I can do Oba. Oba's Cursed Trove. 40% more monster life, increased monster damage, areas patches of desecrated ground. Area becomes fatal after some time? What the fuck? There's a time limit. Oh shit, there's a time limit. A ghastly influence okay. lives in this map. Germinating. It's less common. Dangers. It's ten mins, you're fine. Stay okay. Alright. I'm definitely gonna have to try and rush through this one then. No taking my time. Stairs. I should be fine. Ten minutes seems seems like plenty of time, I would imagine. Assuming I don't get lost. I can't do this just yet. What do you mean you can't do it? What tier is this again? Was this like a tier 10, I think? Oh shit, dead end. Wait, what? There's a dead end. Am I just supposed to kill everything? Oh no, there's the door. Okay, so I had to kill everything. I can leave, but still just chilling, debating if I'm going to brick my helm I'm crafting. <laughs> uh, I have yet to brick anything I was crafting, but I have bricked maps before. I haven't been unfortunate enough yet to break something I crafted. God help me the day I do. Oh no. Alright, we're good. Vanguard belt, okay. So it looks like I just have to kill everything in the area in order to unlock the next section. Upgrade my gem. Alright, where's the door? Where's the door? Come on. There it is. Full clear each level, okay. Vol scouting report, okay. Oh, that's good, I need those. All right, so we gotta go quick and clear everything. Now, is it 10 minutes per room? Or 10 minutes in total? Ten minutes total. Shit. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta move then. Let me put down a portal, just in case it kills me. I don't know how long I've been in here. Probably like three or four minutes at this point. Ah, fuck, come on. I almost missed this room. All right, there's the door. Go. Adrenaline. The thing is that the thing is going to get me killed is like one random mob that gets away and I don't notice. And I can't find it. Oh god, this guy's tough.
Okay, so far so good. All right, we've not killed everything. What am I missing? Shit. There we go, I see it. Oh no, come on, get over there. Die. God amount of times I bricked minions are aggressive wands this league. You get an audible warning time. Okay. Area goes up by one level per floor too. Oh, it does. Okay. I wonder how many floors there are. Oh, don't tell me. I'll figure out how many floors there are. <laughs> I'll find out. Hopefully I'm close because I think it's probably been like maybe six minutes at this point. Yeah, I'm focusing up. <laughs> I'm focusing. I don't want to die. I'm more than half a level. Oh, no. My XP bar is more than halfway full. I, I can't afford to keep losing levels, losing experience. There we go. Crafting recipe. Oh, shit. Oh, Lord. Okay, this is dangerous. This might get me killed. This might get me killed. I'm not identifying them, but I don't think I have time. All right, we're good, we're good. Is that everything? Orb of augmentation, take all these. Cobalt jewel, augmentation. The gem cutter. Okay, we're good. So I'm done, right? All right, map is complete. Let's get out before it kills me. If it kills you, map bricks, basically. Oh, does it really? It's better to move a little slower and be thorough than just move fast once you're sure they're dead. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I didn't die. So that's good. And that was a Kirok mission. So now hey. he should have an updated inventory. Yes, Wharf, I need that. Come on, give me another one low level that I need. Damn it. Sulfur vents. So, I need to double check if I have these already. Let me double check if I have these. Okay, so sulfur vents, sulfur vents, museum. Dark Spring Woods map and estuary. I've definitely done the estuary. Got my, eye on you. my god, my hideout is a mess. <laughs> Let's see. I don't have sulfur vents. I don't have museum. Okay, and I don't have shrine. So we're gonna buy all. Oh, and I don't have forbidden woods. Okay, so we're gonna buy everything he has. Assuming he doesn't want chaos for them. Oh, he wants chaos for these. Son of a bitch. Worf is my favorite Star Wars character. I don't know enough about Star Wars to know who Worf is. <laughs> Had to count. Grab the vessel from your map device and right-click it so you... Oh, yeah, the Pantheon power. I forgot. I totally forgot. The job never ends. Fuck yeah. So now I have 50% reduced effective chill on you. That's awesome. It goes away. Wait. So that does show the other players, it goes away after a while. I'm not that worried about it, it's fine. Um, okay, let's go ahead and put, I right, let me put all my stuff away. And let me see if I can sell this belt for anything. Armor and evasion, increased max life, cold resistance, uh, melee hits, which stun fortify. You have onslaught while fortified. That's interesting. Let's see what this is worth. Two chaos, five, okay, we're gonna sell it. Hail, God Slayer. Unless I wanna use this. No, it doesn't have enough resistances. 1% increased attack damage per 200 of the lowest of armor and evasion rating. What does that mean? Oh, I get it. 
1% increased attack damage per 200 of the lower of armor evasion rating. So what is my current armor and evasion rating? 16,000 is armor. Evasion rating is 1,800. So 2%, so 1,800, so 1% 1 per 200. So uh, 1,800 divided by uh, 200 is, uh, what is that, eight? So that's 8% 8 increased damage. 9%, yeah. You have a gajillion armor but low evasion, yeah. It's not really worth the 9%. 9% well, increased damage is not nothing, but I need I would need to compensate for the resistances. Yeah, I'm not going to use it. I'm going to sell it. Hail, God I think resistances right now are more important than 9% than more damage. Because what's my damage isn't that bad at the moment. It's it's mostly just getting one shot. Uh, okay, let's see. Let's identify these. Um, map contains Baron Citadel. Uh, item quantity increased. Increases amount of rewards Baron drops by twenty percent of its value. Physical damage is cold. Thirty five increased life. Buffs on player expire seventy percent faster. Okay, I can probably do this one. Let me go ahead and corrupt it. Okay. Players have a 40% chance reduced, reduced chance to block. Monsters poison and hit. Okay, that's fine. Let's get this one ready. It's a tier 11, so... One, two, three, four. I'm running out of orbs of alchemy. 100% increased area of effect. Increased monster damage, movement speed, attack speed. Okay, that's fine. Vol Orb. Players have minus nine to all max resistances. Players are cursed with elemental weakness, vulnerability. Okay. Uh, this is a tier two. Okay, so that one's fine as it is. You'll probably find Baron pretty hard at this point. What's your lightning damage? I mean, resist. My lightning resist is, it should be fairly high. Lightning resist is 121. Let me get these Atlas points out of the way. Uh, I have one left. Uh, let's see. I could get these. Don't want to get over there? No. You probably don't want to do this for the first time, but all those guardian maps, like Baron, can be witnessed by Maven to store the bosses for special invitations. Mm. If you stand off the bad, totally doable, but yeah, Gary's right, and also pretty hard amongst the guardians. I'd try Shaper Guardians all first. So wait, adding Maven to the map would make the boss fight more difficult? I guess that makes sense because she kind of uh, fucks with you, doesn't she? Yeah. When rolling maps, you can use orbs of binding in place of orbs of alk. Okay, okay, cool. Thank God. It can make it a lot harder. Okay. Let me get rid of that. Uh, I don't know what next to do on my atlas tree. I know eventually I need to get these, right? Monsters packs influenced by conquerors in your map. Don't I eventually need to grab all these? Or no? Yeah, forgetting boss maps. Baron is a conqueror map. Okay. You need to get off the no scarab node as soon as you can and get some scarabs. I'll probably do that once I complete my atlas. All right. Let's go ahead and run this tier two really quick. It should be simple enough. I'm not even gonna read it, it's fine. 
I just do your first bear map with Eater slash Exarch influence and be careful about what altars you choose so they don't buff the boss. But you could probably afford to try Baron after leveling up because you have two of his map. Okay. You can nail all the important Alice completed nodes with the points you have. Okay. Yeah, I probably could. I probably could. I don't really use scarabs at the moment, though. But once I start farming, I'm assuming that's when I'll start really using them. Got the sulfite, buff me. Okay, this is a tier two. So nothing should be too hard here. I say that now. <laughs> I say that now. But I'm assuming nothing should be too difficult. I can't do this just yet. Oh wait, that's not the proper grammar, is it? Nothing should be too difficult. That's not how you say that. There isn't anything that should be too difficult. Nothing should be too difficult. That doesn't sound right. Nothing should be too difficult. I do love the stink of victory. Wait, hold on, let me grab the shrine. I did exactly what you're doing, but I realized it was not sufficient as I should have been. Ooh, what's this? Hold on, what did I get? Sector Helm. You need to use Scarabs right this second to use Domination Scarab of Teaching for two maps and you'll be level 92. Not literally. <laughs> Joking about the second part. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright, well, it's kind of fun doing lower tier maps, I'm not going to lie. Because you just demolish everything within seconds. I do enjoy it. <laughs> I enjoy the power fantasy. Oh, map's complete. Wharf complete. Okay, we're done. We are done. Uh, let me check out this helmet. 78% increased armor and evasion, 13 to all elemental resistances, minions. Okay, so it's a minion. Related one chaos. Okay, okay we're just going to sell it. Let's just sell it to Lily. And then put all this away. Okay. New vault reward. Oh, let's go get that. Yeah, let's go get the vault reward. Uh, wait, no. I remember how to get there. If you want to level up something really quick, definitely suggest despecking uh, despec de the no scarabs as soon as possible. Running some domination for of teaching scarabs, it will skyrocket your experience. Yeah, it's th there's been some back and forth about whether or not I should have it on. I decided just to go for it um, to to boost the amount of maps I get. It's annoying. I can't use my auras here my abilities superior estuary map I've already done that one in end game stacking your maps with the right scarabs is the way to go people often trade them by hundreds the scarabs that boost map drops far outweigh the power of that node oh, that's a conqueror's map oh because it's superior it's a Drox map. That was a boss map. Oh, let's do it. You think I can do it? Uh, ooh. Superior just means quality. The base map is estuary. Oh, I see. Map contains Drox's citadel. Item quantity decreases amount of rewards. You want these boots for 10 chaos? Uh, what boots? Which one should I do next? Okay, let me think. This is a tier 15, it contains Baron Citadel. Um, so I can either do Baron Citadel, I could do Bog Map tier 12. Oh no, that one's complete. Let me see, what are these? Uh, 41 chance to avoid bleed, 4% increased action speed, 41 to strength, 
12 to increase rarity of items found. 20 to increase movement speed. 15 to fire and chaos. Um, da, 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 da. No, I don't think so. Just because it doesn't have as much chaos resistance as my current boots. 14 chance to gain onslaught. I mean, they don't look bad. I would just be losing chaos. Identify the Drox map, okay. I don't know. I think I'll stick with what I have for the Chaos Resistance. But I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, let's identify this. Let's identify these. Map contains Drox's Citadel. Uh, monsters deal 104% extra physical damage as lightning. Monsters take 39 reduced extra damage from critical hits. All monsters damage from hits ignite. Monsters have 20%. Okay, that's fine. That's totally fine. I can do that. Turn down action speed for 10C. I'm hurt. I also had a feeling it wasn't worth, uh, <laughs> wasn't worth the 10C. I had a feeling that was worth more. Uh... Let's do this one. Let's do let's do Baron. Not perfect item. In a crafting league. That's why I asked Chef for clarity, yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's do this one really quick. Uh map contains Baron Citadel. Oh wait, do I need to do anything to this first? Do I need to take a divine? Vessel. I don't need to take a divine vessel with this one, do I? No. They're really good boots, don't get me wrong, but nobody will buy them. Interesting. No, okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I did Eater of Worlds. That's fine, right? That's fine. I think that's fine. Okay, okay. 50% uh, increased life for each alive monster in pack. Gain 24% non chaos damage, extra chaos damage. Oh shit. Alright, let's do it. Underground River. Okay. Why am I opening chests? Why do I do these things? <laughs> my, I see a chest sometimes and my brain just goes, ooh. What is that? What is this? I'm afraid to walk in it. What is this? Just don't pick any altars that buff the boss. Okay. Barrel and ghost stratus for you. It's barren influence. It's a square of fuck you. It drains mana. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> there I am just standing in it while I ask what it does. <laughs> Got it. Oh, my God. Wait. I just almost died. <laughs> standing in the trap. Oh, what is this? What does this do? Get out of it. Damn it. I want to get the bog map. I don't know if that's one I've done. I think it is one I've done, but still. All right, come on. Ooh, something, something shiny just dropped. Okay. Let's keep moving. I'm ready to fight the Baron. What is that? What is that? Oh, it's in the trap. Grab it. Okay, we're good. You have enough HP regen to negate its health degen. Okay. Wait, it's a dead end. What the fuck? Oh, no, I see it. I see where to go. Grab the shrine. That'll help. What is that? Okay. I probably still won't have the buff from the shrine though by the time I get to Baron. Oh my god. There's so much going on. I don't need the contract. 
There's so much going on on my screen. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. Orb of Unmaking. I'm almost leveled up. I've almost got a level. I cannot die here. I do not want to die. Enslaved Helion. Oh, I missed a shrine. Cruising, yeah. I'm trying to go quick. Okay. Here we are. I leveled up. Okay, good. Now if I die, I won't go down a level. That's nice. Is this the Baron? No. Oh, this is... This must not be the right arena. Oh, wait, no. He's still alive. Oh, it that fell. Oh, this is him. Abyss hole behind you? Oh, I missed it. Shit. Oh, I'm gonna die. Where is he? Where is he? I can't do this just yet. Come on! Fuck! That's fine. I had just gotten to a new level, so I literally lost nothing. Can try going back for it if you hurry. It's probably gone now, right? Oh, I killed him. We, we, we KO'd each other. Plateau map. It's, oh, it's gone. Oh, I left the area, so it's gone. Okay. No. What, what is happening? There we go. Incomplete. Okay, so I have not done plateau. Oh, it's a tier 16. Oh, shit. It despawns if you leave the area. You died to shock plus some type of degen or something. Auras and Crusaders Sanctum. Okay. Look at all these maps I have. A lot of them I've completed, though. Shit, yeah. Alright, let me see if he dropped anything else that's not showing up. Wait, Crusader Sanctum? What is this? What is this? Oh! It's another boss fight. Oh my god, this music is awesome. My auras, you're right. That is barren. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> oh shit, okay. The first was just the map boss, then you open the portal to barren. All right, before I go back in here, I just want to say this music is amazing. Also, I don't, I don't think I stand a chance. Yeah, I don't think I stand a chance. All right, I'm going to hone in. This fight is dope. All right, I'm focusing. Zero death. Oh, my God. Uh, he attacks pretty slow, so that's good. Oh no. Oh no, that hit me. I can barely get a hit in. My spirits are spent. What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? Okay, so I can't step in those squares. Okay. Ooh. I just barely avoided that somehow. Fuck. Oh my god. Holy shit. That's Kirok's brother. Wait, is this really Kirok's brother? Stand on safe boxes. Hard to avoid and keep DPS as melee. It's really fucking hard. He just shotgunned me to the face. <laughs> I have three more attempts. I don't think this is going to happen. We'll see. 
Watch him, watch him just take me out immediately. Like that. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, why am I so bad? No, I, I don't want you to kill him. <laughs> I want to do it. Oop, no, don't do that. I have two more attempts. Maybe if your build was worth 1,500 divs, you'd be able to kill him. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe if I wasn't terrible at this game, I'd be able to kill him. Okay, okay. All right, so I need to avoid that. Oh, my God. All right. I have one more chance. This is not looking good. This is not looking good. Here we go. It's his brother. That's interesting. I, I would not have known that. After he does this to you a few times, you'll wish someone had killed him. No, because I got I would. I would regret it if somebody else killed him for me. I want to do it myself. All right, let's do it. At least I don't have experience to lose. I can't do this just yet. Okay, I have a 20% cold too. So that will help once I, I just need to get him to 20% health. What's he doing? What's he doing? I'm dead. I'm dead. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. Get out, get out, get out. Move, 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 move. Okay, okay, okay. It's getting hard to dodge him with these stupid squares. Oh my god. Oh my god, and I can't be this far away from him. Fuck! That's it. That's it. I'm just I'm just not good enough to do it yet. Oh my god. I think I did okay. I got him to Oh my god, I got him to like 45% health. I do have a spare baron map so I can try again. Hey, look, he has a modifier that says he cannot be fully slowed. He will never be me. <laughs> he will never be me. He may be able to kill me, but he can't be slowed. Not like me. You just saw the fight mechanics at least. Yeah, and I feel like I got that last attempt. I do feel like I did a little bit better. I think if you had the boots, you would have won. <laughs> Probably not. Well, at least I didn't lose any experience. The pro strat for baiting those squares is just to jump in the same corner every time when he charges up that attack. Ah, that makes sense. He shoots it where you're standing. Okay, that makes sense. I don't know why I didn't think about that. I thought it was just random, the ones he selected. I don't know why I was thinking it was random. Okay... You eat the degen for a few seconds, but it spawns the squares in the same spot every time. Yeah, the problem with the degen is that I don't have a lot of mana to work with, so it takes my mana, and then I can't use my mobility skills. I hate that fight. I kind of like the music. If you stand in the corner, it just takes away two sides. All right, let's get my next... Let's get my next... That makes sense. Okay. I need to memorize when he's doing it then. It's like when he charges up like this and he says something when he does it. Let me look at my build guide. Tree. Okay, so it wants me to go for... I can't get these yet. I can't get these yet because I can't have my life pass my accuracy. So what I really need is an accuracy boosting boost. 
I just don't like the Elder Guardians for real. Snake, snake bitch is super annoying. I haven't met her yet. Beef? This one is just called beef. <laughs> this this passive skill is just called beef. Why is that funny to me? Yeah, I'm padded to the left. I've got everything here. Beef. <laughs> Uh, let me see if I do. Let me just double check that I do have everything here. I actually have more than I need. Yeah, I actually have more than I need. Hmm. Maybe I should increase the level. It's the best node. That node gave my build 1.2 mil DPS if I click it. Wait, beef does? 30 to strength. It's the best node. Strength stacking fun. So for the conquerors, apart from Baron, there's Mr. Fister, Ice Waifu, and Danger Noodle Man. <laughs> I think these are left over, so I think I have uh, these ones here left over from when I was doing my the leveling version of this build. I recently swapped over to the mapping, to like the 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 mid yeah mid game level ninety. Um. And I can't grab this yet. 25% increase max total life. I can't grab that one yet. Yeah, anti-corpse explosion is pretty smart. Yeah, it's it's actually saved me, I think, quite a bit, especially when opening strong boxes. I don't think there's anything I can really grab. I mean, I could I could grab something for fun and refund it later. Is there anything that actually gives me more accuracy? Let me see. That might be smart. Grabbing more accuracy might be smart. Green nose to the left. Let's see here. I'm really bad at seeing these. 12% increased global accuracy rating. Is there anything I can grab without having to allocate too many points? Buy your intelligence node. That is the most efficient accuracy node near you, really. My intelligence node. Oh, this one. So I'd have to go up into here. <clears throat> I guess it's worth it. I can always refund it. And I'm going here and, and get these increases to my accuracy. Yeah, if I get these, then I probably won't have to worry about my health outpacing my accuracy anymore. And the regen node to the right. Ooh. Uh, I think I have another thing that prevents me from regening health, though. Yeah, I think I think I have a, a yeah vol pact. Yeah. All right, let me let me sell this to her. Uh, actually, let me see if this is worth anything. It probably isn't. No, it's not. All right, sell, and then that's good. Stash. All right, so which ones have I completed? I'm gonna store the ones I've completed. Oops. All right, so bog map is complete. Estuary. Um, this contains Drox. So I'll put that away for now. I have two tier 16s I haven't completed. Shit. Can I do a tier 16? I don't even know that I can do one. I have Terrace. Let's do Terrace. Moose Sorrow. <laughs> Probably can find him a cheapo enchant to do. Drox is Mr. Fister, by the way. Oh, okay. 
Wait, no anoint? What does that mean? All right, let me do let me do this one. Yeah. Players have twenty five percent less air effect. Okay, this is fine. Monsters reflect physical damage. That's fine. That doesn't affect, that doesn't affect me. Real Chad's anoint beef. Wait, what's anointing? Beef is my favorite node. How do you anoint things? <laughs> Cow sad. <laughs> All right, let's do this one. And then, yeah, we'll do this one. And I should probably do, it's a tier 13. So I can do Exarch's influence on it. It's blight anointing. You need sister Cassia. Okay. Anoint amulets with blight oils. Oh, use those lube oils from blight. I remember. Okay. I remember those. Oh, it's a tier 14 now. It's still incomplete. Okay, good. Okay, good, 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 good. Uh, so I think we should do Exarch on it. You can hold alt over a passive to see the oils you need. Oh shit. Clear, clear and sepia. What do the oils do? Do they boost it? There's a notable on each skill tree you want but can't reach. Uh, I don't know yet. I'm just kind of following my build as it comes. You allocate that notable. It gives the notable to you. You anoint your amulet and it allocates the note. Oh, I see. Oh, interesting. They give that passive when you have the amulet on. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, we have Exarch. All right. You could anoint the accuracy node so you don't have to path there. Oh, that's not a bad idea. I like that. All right, where is it again? Uh, let's see. It's not showing up. Oh, here we go, Eagle Eye. Clear oil, clear oil, apples, uh, appalescent. And the big one just says, no, it says nothing. Opal, opal, opalescent. Um, so I could anoint this would be really good. So how do you anoint? So I know you use the oils on an amulet, for instance. So if I did clear, clear opalescent on my amulet. So where are my oils even at? Are they in fragments? Take the items and oils to Cassia. She has the anoint menu. All right, where are my oils? Verdant, amber, sepia, clear. I think, wait, I don't have opalescent. Oh no, I don't have opalescent. Let's see. Fuck, I can't do it. All right, as soon as I get an opalescent, we're doing it. They're randomly in your stash because you don't have a blight tab. Okay. Let me just double check, opalescent. Okay, yeah, I don't have one. You can three to one oils also. Let's try that. Let's try that. Uh, so I have... Okay, let's take... Let's take three of these. Hail, God Slayer. Verdant oil. Damn it. 
There might be another accuracy note on the passive tree you can do that isn't eagle eye. You need a ton to get opalescent. That would use the diff oils. That said, you're not going to get opalescent doing that anytime soon. If you're going to three to one. Okay, so this is not going to get me opalescent. Okay. So, let me see if there's another accuracy node that I can select. 20 to accuracy rating. Let's see about this one. No. 15% to global accuracy rating. That's not horrible. It's not a ton, though. Uh, this would need verdant and verdant opalescent. So, no, not that one. 12% increased global accuracy. Let's see. Let's see, teal, azure, azure, and black. I don't have those either. That's a great note because all the stats really. Yeah, the one I was looking at is really good. There are 13 ranks of oils with opalescent being third from the top. Oh, fuck, okay. So I'm probably not getting that anytime soon. 200 to accuracy rating with axes. Axe attacks deal 30% increased damage with hits and ailments. Amber black, black opalescent. Damn, that's good. Holy shit, that's a good skill. You can buy one for around 15C. You can buy one if you really want to anoint. I'll hold off for now. I'll hold off for now until... Hmm... You don't want to spend much if you got a crappy amulet. Yeah. We really should just buy to anoint. It's not worth farming blight to get that. Unless you enjoy blight. I do like blight. I do enjoy blight. Okay. Let's do this one with Exarch. Uh, attacks always maim. Increase life. Okay. Yeah, I find blight to be kind of fun. I just, I, I don't know. Something about it I like. I, I do too, lazy gaming, yeah. <laughs> oh god, my game lagged. This is a tier 14, right? Yeah, Moonstone Ring. I can't hit them. Why am I so fast? Holy shit. What was that about? The fuck is this about? Why? Wait, my ring is proccing, but it wasn't before? Jeweler's orbs. Oh, I'm dying. Oh my god, there's so many freaking corpses. Okay. Oh my god. Collect, 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 collect. All right, my corpses are full. God damn it. Why am I suddenly really feeling the difference of my my ring? Great shrine combo. Just go kill mobs. Oh, I have the haste shrine. That's why. I thought it was my ring. dead end. God damn. I'm wasting it. I can't do this just yet. Why can't I go? Oh. If I would actually look at the screen instead of just the map. <laughs> All right. Where's the door? What's this floating thing? Well, I don't have it anymore.
Yeah, the doors are kind of hard to see. Estuary map, I already have that one done. I know that for a fact. Jeweler's orbs. Orb of augmentation, orb of fusing. God, I'm not, it's, it's hiding orbs of fusing from me. I want those. I gotta remember to check more often. The catalyst. God, I wonder how many um, of these orbs I've just completely passed up. This map is def one of the done. This map is def a one and done for me for completion. Yeah, it's kind of a maze. Shit. I see the strong box over there, but I'm not gonna take the time to get it. Oh well, shit, where am I supposed to go? Hold on. What am I missing? Uh, I see it, I see it. It's over here. You might have to just your loot filter. Yeah, I'm gonna watch a video off stream on how to actually modify it myself because I definitely wanna be seeing those. Oh, I remember this thing. We just fought this thing. And that one unique, uh, unique map. Maze completed. He dropped nothing. Stiletto, I'll take that. Rogue markers, take those. Okay. Uber Strict will hide a lot of useful stuff. It's truly not worth stopping to pick those up, and I don't mean because of money or speed. The smaller stacks you're not seeing. Yeah, Uber Strict is too much. Yeah, I think it is actually too much. I do think this is too much. Let's go back down. Amazing job. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I guess that's a good stopping place for tonight. How many did we get done? I got down, I got 12 maps done tonight. That's really good. That's really good for me, I should say. Only one tier 16 map for eater, yeah. I think we got a lot done. RSIs. Your wrists and fingers will hate you. Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, I think we got a lot done. It was a good night. Uh, made a lot of progress on my Atlas. I will be live again tomorrow. Um, and that will probably be my last stream for a week. Um, as next week, the baby will be here. So... Yeah, I might stream Monday. We'll see. I might be able to stream Monday. Depends on who's in town, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, I appreciate everybody hanging out. It was fun. I hope everybody has a good night. And yes, thanks, thanks, Ugtug. <laughs> I am terrified. I'll be amazing. I hope so. All right. Thanks, everybody. Have a good night. Peace.